What to do when you feel super bored? Well, I have five super ideas. I hope you like them. If you do, do click the like button and share this video with your friends. Subscribe to my channel and don't forget to click the bell icon. Number one, why don't you make a bucket list? A bucket list is a list of things that you want to do in this life. You know, this term bucket list has come from the expression to hit the bucket. That means to die. So basically, bucket list is a list of things that you want to do before you die. Die, death, these are very depressing terms. But bucket list is not depressing at all. It's basically a list of all your dreams that you want to come true. So sit down and make a list. How many? Generally, people write 10 things that they want to do in their lifetime. Don't write only about your career goals and studies. Of course, that can be one or two of your goals. But the rest, you need to really sit and think. Maybe you want to publish a book. Maybe you want to write poems and get them published. Maybe there is this one place that you want to visit or a particular bike or a car that you want to buy or you want to do something special for your parents. Sit down, think and make the bucket list. When you will be making this list, obviously it's going to be a lot of fun and you will be very excited. Well, who will feel bored while making a bucket list? I don't think so. What do you say? Number two, this is something very emotional. Write a thank you note to a person whom you really want to thank. Maybe this person has done something very special for you when you really needed help. Or this is the person who is very, very special in your life. You can't imagine your life without this person. You know, many a times we think many things, but we really don't express our thoughts. But you know, it's very important to express your feelings. So sit down and write a thank you note, three, four lines, why you want to thank. And of course, you will be writing that I want to thank you. If you want, if you like writing, you can even write a long letter. It's up to you. When you will be writing this thank you note, your heart will be full of gratitude and happiness. And of course, you will love your life even more and think of the person who is going to receive this thank you note that person is going to feel so so special if you have more than one person to thank consider yourself to be very lucky and write the thank you notes to whoever you want to thank in your life number three see old pictures of yourself you know, your childhood pics, like when you were a baby, toddler, you can see your different class photographs with all your different class teachers and friends or photographs uh, with your relatives, holidays, festivals. There are so many photographs. I'm sure it's going to bring back beautiful memories. And of course, it's going to bring a big, broad smile on your face. Number four, change your look. Experiment with your look. Open the wardrobe, take out your clothes and mix and match and wear them. Maybe not the way you generally wear. So try different styles. You can try different hairstyles as well. Don't tell your friends. Next time when you go out with them, you spot a new look and surprise them. Number five. Why don't you make a list of those people who inspire you? So it's going to be my inspirations list and there will be many because your parents then you think of all your relatives your elder brothers or sisters your teachers those who are teaching you now and those who have taught you but they had inspired you and of course there are so many celebrities from sports personalities to film stars to writers activists poets politicians so whoever inspires you sit down think of them and write the names if you want you can collect their pictures and then make a beautiful collage put it up on the wall in your room so that's going to be your permanent source of inspiration and this 
will not only kill your boredom but you're going to feel very positive happy and inspired so do tell me which idea you like the most you can write to me in the comment section and before i sign off i want to tell you one thing two different things in life then life will be interesting and not boring because life has a lot to offer